guys, welcome back to Story Time. And today we're talking about Valentine's Day. It is coming up very soon. But first, let's sing our hello song, which goes like this. Hello, friends, it's time to say hello. Sing along with me, okay? Hello, friends, hello, friends, hello, friends, it's time to say hello. Hi, everybody. And now we're going to sing a song that's called Skidamarink. And this is an I Love You song, so it's perfect for Valentine's Day. Are you ready? Okay, let's sing Skidamarink. Skidamarink, a dink, a dink, Skidamarink, a do. I love you. Skidamarink, a dink, a dink, Skidamarink, a do. I love you. I love you in the morning and in the afternoon. I love you in the evening and underneath the moon. Skidamarink a dink a dink, skidamarink a do. I love you. Skidamarink a dink a dink, skidamarink a do. I love you. I love you in the morning and in the afternoon. I love you in the evening and underneath the moon. Skidamarink a dink a dink, skidamarink a do. I love you. Awesome. And now we're going to keep the theme of love. And we have a book called Love by Stacy McConaughey. Love. Let's see what this book is about. Love is, it looks like we have a group and they're making food. They're making cupcakes and pies and they're making casseroles and something in the oven and something in the stove. Let's see what they're getting ready for. Love is a fancy dinner. She brought a dinner for a puppy. Love needs special presents, like taking care of someone, bringing them a book, bringing cookies, or a special drawing. And designer greeting cards. Looks like they are busy making cards for everybody they love. Love calls for bouquets of flowers, taking flowers for someone who doesn't feel well. And must have the finest chocolates. Love sounds like poetry. They have at the beach, they're spending time together, spending time with a friend. She looks like she hurt her foot and now her friend is taking care of her and spending time together. And this one says, love you, Papa. And has a beautiful melody. They're having fun and singing together in the car. Love comes in the shape of a heart. They're making a heart shape together. And sparkles like diamonds love happens at first sight like with pets or with little brothers and sisters welcome to the family sister it says and needs the tightest hugs love deserves to be shouted from the rooftops because nothing else matters without love. The end. Beautiful. That was a beautiful book about love for friends, for pets, for family. And now we're going to sing a song called Heart. H-E-A-R-T. Let's take a look at the letters. H E. A, R, and T. Let's sing the song. It sounds like bingo, so you can sing along with me, okay? 
and we're going to clap it out just like bingo. I made a valentine for you and this is what it says. Oh, H-E-A-R-T, 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 and this is what it says. Oh, I made a valentine for you and this is what it says. Oh, H-E-A-R-T, 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 and this is what it says. Oh, H. E A R M T and that spells heart. And now we're going to learn how to make a heart with our hands. I can make a heart. I put my hands together. This is where I start. I curve my fingers right around and I can make a heart. I put my hands together. This is how I start. I curve my fingers right around and I can make a heart. You too can make a heart. And we're going to have our last book, which is called Group Hug. Let's See who's hugging each other. Group hug. There once was a slug needing someone to hug. This slug needs someone to hug. Shrug. Along came a beetle, a lonely old bug. You need a hug? I have one, said slug, to keep your heart snug. Hug. Nearby was Mouse with a case of the grumps. He was grumpy. She'd hit a few bumps and was down in the dumps. Chin up, said Bug. There's no need to stew. We'll help you pull through. Your hug's overdue. Group hug. Then up shuffled Skunk, lost control of his smell, and Squirrel as well had been sprayed. You could tell. Their fragrance so foul proved hard to undo. Never mind the P-U, said Mouse. Room for two. Group hug. Now Beaver was busy, too busy for friends. When building his dam, his job never ends. Take a five, a quick break, said Squirrel and Skunk too. Come join our crew. Let the hugging ensue. Group hug. Along came Porcupine feeling quite prickly. I didn't say sickly, just pokey and prickly. She needed a hug cause hugs had been lacking, said Beaver, dear Porcupine, send those quills packing. Shake, 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 shake. Group hug. A groundhog forgotten, a goose out of luck, a fox nicknamed Sneaky, a moose feeling stuck. The group hugs stretch wide and the group hugs stretch tall, making plenty of room for those antlers and all. Then a long lumbered bear needing someone to care, not to snack on, I swear, but they shouted, Beware! And off scampered squirrel and skunk and the smell, off scooted fox and groundhog as well. Off scurried porcupine, no longer prickly, goose and moose, they skedaddled quite quickly. Off skittered mouse, who was no longer blue, and beaver and bug, bear scared them off too. Do you think bear needs a hug? They all scattered away from him, but maybe he just wants a hug. Till the ones left were that brave slug and bear. And slug said, hey there, I've got hugs to spare. See, that slug knew a secret, as sure as she shrugged, that a hugger finds happiness alongside the hugged. Heart tug, group hug, the end. All the 
bear wanted was a hug and slug knew it because hugs makes us feel better when we're feeling down and that was group hug and before we go we're going to sing our goodbye song and come back next week for another story time sing along with me okay goodbye friends goodbye friends goodbye friends it's time to say goodbye bye bye friends happy valentine's day